Hey there, science fans. Today, we're diving into the fascinating world of hydroponics. Have you ever imagined growing fresh, delicious food without using soil? Well, that's precisely what hydroponics allows us to do. It's like giving plants a whole new way to grow. One popular method of hydroponics is called Nutrient Film Technique, or NFT for short. It's a fantastic way to grow a wide variety of plants, from leafy greens to juicy strawberries, right in your own home, with minimal space. Imagine fresh salads every day. That's the beauty of NFT hydroponics. It's water efficient, space saving, and incredibly rewarding. So let's explore this incredible technique and see how you can build your very own NFT system. Ready to unleash your inner gardener? Let's get started. NFT hydroponics is all about giving plants a constant and perfectly balanced supply of nutrients directly to their roots. But instead of soil, we use a shallow stream of nutrient rich water that flows continuously over the plant's roots. Think of it like a tiny river of plant food. This nutrient solution contains all the essential minerals and elements that plants need to thrive. The plant's roots are suspended in the flowing water, ensuring they have constant access to everything they need. This method is super efficient because it eliminates the guesswork of traditional gardening. No more worrying about soil quality, pests, or weeds. Plus, since the nutrient solution is constantly recirculated, NFT hydroponics uses significantly less water than traditional soil-based gardening. It's a win-win for you and the environment. Ready to build your own NFT hydroponic system? Great, here's what you'll need. Growing channels. These are typically PVC pipes cut in half lengthwise. They house your plants and allow the nutrient solution to flow. Reservoir. This is where you'll store your nutrient solution. A large plastic tote or bucket works well. Water pump. This circulates the nutrient solution from the reservoir to the growing channels. Air pump and air stones. These oxygenate the nutrient solution, which is essential for healthy root growth. Growing medium. This provides support for your plants. Rockwool cubes or coco qua are popular choices. pH meter and nutrient solution. These are crucial for maintaining the optimal growing environment for your plants. Now let's put it all together. Step 1. Prepare your growing channels. Drill holes in the top of your PVC pipes to accommodate your plants. Make sure the holes are spaced far enough apart to allow for growth. Step 2. Set up your reservoir. Place your water pump inside the reservoir and connect it to tubing that will lead to your growing channels. Add your air pump and air stones to the reservoir as well. Step 3. Connect the channels and reservoir. Connect the tubing from the water pump to the higher end of your growing channels. The lower end of the channels should drain back into the reservoir, creating a continuous flow. Step 4. Add your growing medium and plants. Place your chosen growing medium in the holes of your growing channels and carefully transplant your seedlings or young plants. Step 5. Fill and monitor. Fill your reservoir with your prepared nutrient solution and plug in your pumps. Regularly monitor the pH and nutrient levels of your solution to ensure your plants are getting everything they need. And that's it. You've built your very own NFT hydroponic system. Now let's talk about which plants thrive in this setup. NFT hydroponics is great for a variety of plants, but some are just naturals in this system. Leafy greens like lettuce, spinach and arugula absolutely love the constant moisture and readily available nutrients. Herbs like basil, mint and cilantro also flourish in NFT systems, rewarding you with fresh flavors for your culinary creations. If you're feeling adventurous, you can even try growing strawberries. Imagine plucking juicy red strawberries right from your indoor garden. It's a real treat. However, it's best to avoid plants with large, heavy root systems like potatoes or carrots. These plants might clog your system and make it difficult to maintain proper water flow. Stick with the stars of NFT and you'll be harvesting deliciousness in no time. Section 5. Maintaining your NFT system, water, nutrients and pH. Keeping your NFT system running smoothly is all about balance. Imagine your plants as picky eaters. They need the right amount of everything to thrive. First, let's talk about water. Since the nutrient solution constantly circulates, you'll only need to top off the reservoir occasionally. Keep an eye on the water level and add more when needed. Easy peasy. Next, we have the nutrient solution. This is the magic potion that keeps your plants happy and well fed. 
you can purchase pre-mixed nutrient solutions specifically designed for hydroponics, or you can mix your own if you're feeling adventurous. Just make sure to follow the instructions carefully to provide your plants with the right balance of nutrients. Finally, let's talk about pH. pH measures the acidity or alkalinity of your nutrient solution. Most plants prefer a slightly acidic environment, around 5.5 to 6.5 on the pH scale. You can easily adjust the pH using pH up or pH down solutions available at hydroponic stores. Regularly check your pH and nutrient levels using a pH meter and adjust as needed. Think of it like giving your plants regular checkups to ensure they're in tip-top shape. Section 6. Troubleshooting your NFT system. Even with the best care, you might encounter a few hiccups along the way. Don't worry, a little troubleshooting can go a long way. Problem 1. Wilting plants. This could indicate a few things, not enough water in the reservoir, a clogged pump, or a nutrient deficiency. Solution. First, check the water level and refill if needed. Inspect your pump and tubing for any clogs and clear them if necessary. If the problem persists, test your nutrient solution and adjust accordingly. Problem 2. Algae growth. Algae love light and nutrients just like your plants. If you see green slime in your system, it's time to take action. Solution. Prevent algae growth by using opaque reservoirs and tubing to block light. If algae are already present, clean your system thoroughly and consider adding a UV sterilizer to your setup. Problem 3. Nutrient deficiencies. Plants can be picky eaters. If you notice yellowing leaves or stunted growth, it might be a nutrient imbalance. Solution. Regularly test your nutrient solution and adjust the levels as needed. Research common nutrient deficiencies for the specific plants you're growing and look for telltale signs. Remember, observation is key. Regularly check your plants and address any issues promptly. Section 7. Benefits of NFT Hydroponics. Why choose this method? By now, you might be wondering, why choose NFT Hydroponics over traditional gardening? Well, get ready for a whole bunch of benefits. Water efficiency, NFT systems use significantly less water than traditional gardening because the nutrient solution is constantly recirculated. That's a big win for the environment. Space saving. You can grow a surprising amount of food in a small space with NFT hydroponics, making it perfect for apartments, balconies, or anyone with limited gardening space. Faster growth. Plants in NFT systems tend to grow faster and produce higher yields because they have constant access to nutrients and optimal growing conditions. No soil, no pests. Say goodbye to weeding, tilling and battling pesky insects. NFT hydroponics eliminates these common gardening headaches. Year-round growing. Imagine fresh homegrown produce all year round. With NFT hydroponics, you can grow your favorite fruits, vegetables and herbs indoors, regardless of the season or weather outside. Section 8. Conclusion. Happy growing. Congratulations. You've just unlocked the secrets of NFT hydroponics. You've learned about the science behind it, how to build your own system, and how to troubleshoot common issues. Now it's time to put your knowledge into action. Remember, gardening is all about experimentation and having fun. Don't be afraid to get your hands dirty, or should I say, wet, and try something new. With a little patience and care, you'll be amazed at what you can grow. So, go forth and start your own hydroponic adventure. Happy growing.